What's up YouTube? In today's video, I'm going to see if I could use this used Android phone as a dedicated gaming slash retro gaming handheld. Handheld gaming devices like the Retro Pocket 3 Plus have become popular and there are a slew of others on the market. I've been considering getting one for a while now, but then I came across a Craigslist listing for a Samsung Galaxy S21. So let's talk about the S21 specs. It's got a Snapdragon 888, 8 gigs of RAM, a 1080p resolution screen, USB Type-C, and a 6.2 inch screen. This is a more powerful device than a lot of the handhelds on the market right now, which is exactly why I picked it up. So what I'm gonna do today is give this a run for its money. I'm going to try some Android games, some retro gaming, and some cloud gaming as well. Of course, you can use the touchscreen to play games, but I'm not a fan, so I'll be using a Backbone 1 controller. I think this controller is great and would highly recommend it. Another option would be one of those uh, clip mounts for, say, an Xbox controller, but I'm not a big fan of those either. Okay, so let's get into some gameplay. First up is Call of Duty Mobile. All right, next up we have Real Racing 3. A great thing about this phone is that it still plays Fortnite and it plays it well on the S21. It's a bummer that this can't be done on an iPhone unless you are using game streaming, which isn't too bad, but it's just better playing on a device directly. Now let's try some retro gaming. This is Comic Zone for Sega Genesis and I'm using the Lemroid app. All right, now let's try some PSP emulation using the PPSSPP emulator. And next up is some PS1 emulation.
All right, next up we have PS2 emulation, and uh, it ran really well on this. All right, now let's try Redream, the Dreamcast emulator. All right, now we're going to try the Dolphin emulator for some GameCube and some Wii emulation. It can even do Xbox Cloud Gaming. Here's Forza Horizon 5.
And it could even do Starfield with game streaming. So I am really impressed with this phone. The S21 can play so many games and definitely makes a great dedicated handheld gaming device. Besides all the games I've shown here, it can easily play Minecraft, uh, Roblox, uh, PUBG. It also has USB Type-C video out so you can play on a big screen if you want. Uh, the one emulator I did forget to try was Vita 3K, but I think it won't have an issue with that one at all. So that's going to do it for this video. Please hit that like and subscribe button. I would appreciate it. Thanks for watching.